sounds great. Coming up, I put it all on the line for the Chevy Impala. I cannot go a penny higher than that. I'm done at 7,500. And a radio station actually lets Tommy go on the air. I think that she should come down to the lot. She sounds cute. <laughs> <laughs> We're from Broadway Motors. Here to yeah. see Ralphie. All right, I'll bring you guys back. Come Thanks, on. man. Today we're at 94X FM, and we're really trying to drum up some business for Broadway Motors. I'm just hoping Tommy doesn't run his mouth on the air and get us in any kind of trouble. Hey! hey. What's up, pal? What are you guys doing? It's great to see you, man. You. How's everything? Everything's good. I know Mikey and Tommy a long time, you know, since we're high school kids. All right, guys, stand by. We're going to go live in about a minute. <clears throat> Long Island's all new, 94X. All right, it's Broadway Motors, Route 110 in Amityville. My guys are here, my car guys, my paisans, my, my goombatas. Oh, Ralphie! 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 All right, it's Big Sale. Marion, what's going on with the Big Sale tomorrow? Well, we're going to be selling a lot of cars, eating a lot of food, but hopefully more selling a lot of cars. You know what it is, Ralph, right now? I got some cars down here for 1995. It's like unheard of in my business. Yeah. Those cars always move, and that's what we're looking to push tomorrow. Some real affordable cars, because that's what people need right now. 1995. Four cylinders, six cylinders. I got a 20 on me right now. <laughs> <laughs> we're really hoping by putting it out there that we're having a sale, that we're going to drum up some interested buyers and load up the lot with customers. Stacy is in Bayshore. Stacy, you're up. Good morning. I was just wanting to sell my 2004 Nissan Maxima. It's a pretty awesome car. It has leather seats, 78,000 miles. And I'm selling it for 14000 So you guys think it would be better to sell it at a used car dealership or online? Uh, Tommy, your thoughts? I think that she should come down to the lot. She sounds cute. <laughs> <laughs> He's like the Italian Crazy Eddie. God bless you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now for the sensible, smart answer. Uh, Mikey Jr. It's always easier to sell your car to a dealer. You work out a deal, you get a check cut on the spot, and you go home. She's not going to get that gonna price, Ralphie, but you know what? When she comes down, we'll give her a little bit of education. And even if she, we don't buy the car, she knows where she's at for the future. So I would say bring the car down, and we'd love to see it. You're a small business owner, and it's it's got to be tough right now. Small business is tough. Yeah. But we have a lot of fun with it. We have more fun in sales. <laughs> I <gotta> say. <laughs> a lot of people can say that they go to work and have fun, too. Yeah. We go to work, we make money, and we have a lot of fun. Well, I'm hoping this did the trick. We just got a lot of new cars in, and we need a big Saturday to put us ahead. Guys, as always, wonderful to see you, and uh, come back anytime. You're only yes, right now. It was a pleasure, pleasure being here. And the well, next time, bring some cannolis, would you? You got yes, it. Man, absolutely. No <laughs> All right, coming back at you in a couple minutes right here on Long Island's all new 94X.